Andrew Tate. Andrew Tate. So Andrew Tate. So Andrew Tate. So Andrew Tate. So Andrew Tate. Virtually every tech company on the planet banned him. So I became the most viral person on the planet with all the algorithms working against me. Channel and welcome to the pregame. Hello, it's Doug from Behind Closed Doors. For those of you that watch my channel, you know that I talk about relationships, and I think that the three most important things in a relationship are honesty, trust, and respect. And if you have honesty, trust, and respect, you're gonna have a great relationship. And if you don't have one or all of those three fundamental things, then the relationship's not gonna end well. Most of this channel has been reacting to dating coaches. I've given the odd bit of advice myself, but Really, it's been reacting to dating coaches. And also that ties into people in the manosphere and the red pill space and all that kind of stuff. One of the channels that I've been impressed with most throughout um, doing these reaction videos is just pearly things. I think uh, Hannah there is doing a fantastic job of getting that conversation going. And the person that seems to have the best advice for men and women when it comes to dating is Andrew Tate. And I just finished watching a podcast where Andrew Tate was on with Just Pearly Things. And it was about three hours long or whatever. And I sat and watched the whole thing. And you had uh, Auntie there that was like, she's an OG, she's brilliant, love Auntie. If you've got something to say, just say it. Don't no. beat around the bush. Andrew Tate, my son's older than him, so I don't give a damn who he is. Um, then you had this other girl that was yapping away, talking shit about absolutely nothing and getting everyone's nerves. Men don't want to change. They're not oh, accountable no, for themselves. And then you had Tate, who was just spitting out wisdom. I want Chris Brown. And then they'll go try and get Chris Brown. Then Chris Brown will cheat. <laughs> I am devastated. Well, what the f*** do you think is going to happen? And then there was two other girls there that I didn't know sitting next to him uh, that well. But the one closest to him seemed to be kind of cool. And the other girl was cool, but she was a lot more quiet. And she seemed to have been a lot more harshly judged. Unnecessarily so, maybe. When I first started this channel, not many people were doing stuff that was anti-feminist and all that kind of stuff. Now that there seems to be loads of channels, you've got Fresh and Fit, you've got the Just Pearly Things, you've got loads of other ones that people have shown me and I just don't, I can't keep track of them all. They're all been broken down into little short clips and the message is spreading how bad feminism has been and what a shit show it's been and how it's destroyed the family home and it's destroyed the, the beautiful natural connection between men and women. Let's say God is that force which produces life and that comes as a result of men and women getting together so it's not the man it's not the woman it's their union that creates life and that is like the most sacred thing that we can have because there's nothing else that creates human beings other than uh, men and women so the beautiful sacred bond between men and women has been destroyed but and i think it's intentional as well like i've explained in other videos and i honestly don't know what the solution is and when I was listening to Tate, and again, he's he knows the game inside now, and he doesn't seem to have any good answers either, because it's a shit show. Because the Western world has collapsed in real time, and it's a failed society. And one of the reasons it's a failed society is because of the over-sexualization, especially of females as a whole. There is no easy answer. And this is the yeah. question, what's the easy answer? What's the no, answer when the, state, when the state is going to destroy you regardless? Well, no, what's the answer? No, there is no answer. I mean, you need to find some guy you can trust with your money. If you have a good brother, send him the money, and then, you know, I don't know, you can play all these things. Yeah, you can set up your assets in a you way. You can set up your protected. assets and stuff, but still, she's always going to have the advantage. She can still go to court and lie and say you intimidate her and take your kids from you. What yeah. can you do? I, I, even I don't know. What, what can you do? I mean, people come to me all the time inside of my war room. I've got my private members community, and people mm -hmm. join. They say, I'm in the West, and I'm worried about getting divorce raped, and I'm worried about uh, the female imperative, and I'm worried about the left, mm -hmm. and I'm worried about this. What should I do? And I say, look, become anti-fragile, put money in a foreign bank account, and get the ability to get the fuck out. Yeah. I'm like, oh, yeah, but what else can I do? I'm like, nothing. What do you mean, what else yeah. can you do? Yeah. You're living in a country where if you ha get a woman pregnant by accident, your fucking life's over. You're living in a country where you can marry a woman and she can divorce you and completely destroy your life and turn your son into a fucking girl without your permission. Mm -hmm. And you want me to help you? What the fuck you want me to do? Like, yeah. you, you got to have, you gotta have the ability to get the fuck out. And, 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 and that's the only thing there is. If I had a, an American wife, I'm a spiteful motherfucker. I'm going to say it now. Mm. I'm spiteful. So if I had an American wife and we were getting a divorce, I would set the house on fire before I'd give her a fucking thing. That's just mm. who I am as a man. Mm -hmm. But, um, you know, you got to have the ability to pick your son up for, for his visit and get on a plane and get the fuck out of there. Because mm. you're living in a world where you don't stand a chance. The system is so rigged against you. To think you can even use the system to protect yourself in any regard is, is infantile. Mm -hmm. And when that's why people come to me and they go, what do, we, what do I do? I'm living in the West. I'm concerned about X, Y, Z. I'm like, look, you need a backup plan. And your backup plan is to get the fuck out. 
because it ain't getting better anytime soon. And there's very little you can do against the weight of the system. And it, it's, we, I mean, we've discussed all these themes before. And we'll go into them again, I'm sure. Mm-hmm. Everything from marriage to having kids to divorce, everything, you're, the whole system is rigged against you. And, and they will destroy your life. They will destroy your life from head to toe. And they don't give a shit how you feel. Yeah, that's it. That's it. it. I'm here to see if Mr. Tate can learn something from me. <laughs> what would I do? <laughs> okay. <laughs> So although this isn't technically a reaction to the Just Pearly Things podcast with Andrew Tate, I'm going to leave a link to it in the description below. And for those of you who haven't seen it, I highly recommend that you check it out because it really covers a lot of ground in there. Um, If you can shift through all the stuff where people are shouting it over the top of each other and just listen to the parts where people are actually saying their experiences and what they believe and think. Uh, Pearl's done a, a really good podcast there she's really hit the nail on the head and i've seen various different videos of andrew and he's just spot on in this one it's, it's he absolutely nails it take good care of yourselves hello my name is doug and i've created a video tutorial called what to message a girl for online dating success the reason why i've created this product is to help those men out there who are dating online but are not getting the replies or getting the dates that they desire My product will teach you what to message a girl, what not to message a girl, when to message a girl, how to respond when you're not sure what to write, what to do if she doesn't reply, how to get her phone number, and how to communicate to get online dating success. If you're getting matches and no success, this product is for you. It's what you need to do today to start getting success with your matches. I'll also be talking about other issues such as how to spot red flags, identify time wasters, to stay out the friend zone, how to deal with ghosting, simmering and icing. Not only will I be giving you exactly what you need, copy and paste, I'll also be explaining to you the reason why I'm writing what I'm writing so you can understand the psychology and know what behaviours to look out for and which ones to avoid. This product is packed with value. I've tried to cram as much as I can into a short amount of time as possible while being the most informative. If you're a man and you're confused and frustrated with what to text with online dating, this product is the solution for you to get more dates in less time. Click the link in the description box below to buy the product and change your dating life forever.